Hello lovelies, welcome back to the channel. Today I am bringing to you a really tiny haul from Sephora. I just wanted to share one of the items that I recently bought. It is this Give Me Some Lip Collection and of course everything else fell. Okay, so Give Me Some Lip. Um, what fell were the freebies that I got with it. I'll show you those first really quickly. So the first was this Buxom eyeshadow. Um, really. This Buxom eyeshadow. This one is called Mink Magnet. It's a really pretty coppery, light copper, maybe not copper, like a pinkish silver. Really, really pretty. So, um, this was a nice little sample. It was a hundred point perk is what it was. So I did spend some points on this. Maybe this but was a freebie. What is the step one, um, makeup forever skin equalizer base hydrating primer or hydrating primer I was reading the French version. So I haven't used this yet. It, I've heard good things about these, um, for makeup forever. So I look forward to using this. It was nice to get it for, uh, free. These are definitely free little, um, hourglass samples and then um a glam glow daily exfoliating cleanser so i guess it's not one of their masks mud mud to foam just a cleanser okay so my three little samples but so this um kit this give me some lip kit super cute shape of lips one of the reasons i bought this one versus the other give me some lips collection because or give me some lip collection because the other one is just in a square box it's pretty it's like pink and gold but i was like how cute is it to have lips so lips there it is and i just thought i'd do a couple little like swatches on my hand of these for you so you can know if you if you're interested in this kit if you think these colors actually would be flattering i am wearing this sephora brand Rouge Infusion, the neutrals. Um, it's just, it just, I think it's just called a lip ink today. So this is what is on my lips right now. And I guess I'll just go ahead and swatch it for you. It is pretty sheer. Um, very pinky. But on my lips it comes off more berry. So I'm pretty happy with that. It's not... Um, one of those liquid lipsticks or a mattifying lipstick or anything like that. It's it's really more like a gloss. It smells strongly of like a, a chemical scent that's trying to be floral maybe. It goes away. It's not like I can smell it on my lips or taste it on my lips or anything like that. But it, And it is a nice color so I'm happy with that one. This is the Marc Jacobs La Creme lipstick. This one is in Je T'aime. So Le Marc Lip Cream. I'm sorry, Le Marc Lip Cream in Je T'aime. So cute little packaging, just the mini of their regular packaging, I believe. And this one is right here. This is really nice. It's a very similar shade, actually, now that I'm seeing them together, but obviously a very different texture. You know, this one's going to go on more like a lipstick, right? And this one goes on more like a gloss. Um, but very nice. I like I like this one too. And then we have a sample of the Makeup Forever new Plexiglosses. Artist Plexiglos. It's just, I mean, it's it, it looks pinkish, but it comes out pretty nude. Ooh, and thick. Ugh. <laughs> um... So this might be a good topper if you wanted to make one of the other matte items in this kit. Glossy. It's just there. Very sheer. Or, you know, on a no makeup makeup day, right? This might be a nice enhancement for lips. I have not put this on yet, so I don't know exactly how it wears. But if it's anything like it, it swatches on my hand. It's pretty darn sheer, right? So, okay, and then Sugar Rose Tinted Lip Treatment, sunscreen of SPF 15. Um, this is what it looks like. And then it goes on really clear. So I think this is just supposed to be like a slightly, slightly tinted lip balm. You can see the pinkiness right there. And you can even tell by looking at it that it has a translucent quality to it and again I have not tried this one on 
either, but it's so sheer. This one, this um, plexiglass is probably even more sheer um, or clear, and then the um, sugar or the fresh sugar rose lip treatment is a little bit more pink. It'll probably enhance the pink in your lips just a little bit, but it's not going to do a whole lot for you. But I've heard these are um, very moisturizing, so it's nice to have this little sample to try. And they're also very expensive, so to get the sample to try, um, and I don't know if I said it, but all of this, this whole kit was $25. So you get to try some really, really nice high-end items and some um, you know, things like Sephora brand, but this is the only Sephora brand in here. All the rest is, um, pretty high in demand items. So, okay, so there's that. And then we have a Tarte lipstick. I believe this is full size. Amazonian Butter Lipstick, um, in Coral Blossom. So, these tubes are so cute. Uh, it is a cardboard tube though, which I find strange. I don't know, we'll see how that goes. So here's what it looks like. And let's put this guy on. So this is a light color, but it seems like it's, um, you know, it's not too sheer. It's just the nature of that color where it's not gonna, you know, give you all that much, but it is pretty pigmented. And it seems like it's gonna give you, not full coverage for your lips, but a good solid color. Um, on your lips. So there's the coral, coral blossom. And then last but not least, we have Kat Von D's ever so famous Lolita. Um, this is the, what is it technically called? Everlasting Liquid Lipstick in Lolita. And this really does look so brown. Again, I haven't put this on yet. I think the pinkish hues in it might show up a little bit better on. People say it's so flattering, but um, I I need, I need to, well, I need to try it. Just like I need to try most of these things, right? Um, and even on my hand, I did swatch these last night. This one dried down so matte. Like I touched it about 10 minutes later, still a little bit sticky, but you could definitely see it drying down. So, okay, it, it even looks less brown on my hand. I don't know, I don't know how I feel about this. But there's Lolita, so that's a nice little sample. You don't have to spend all $22 to try some to try it. Okay. There's Lolita. Okay, here is the Tarte um, Lipstick in Coral Blossom. Here is the uh, Fresh Sugar um, Lip Treatment in Rose or Rose. Okay, here is the Makeup Forever. Ooh, there it is, Plexigloss. Okay, so there's the Plexigloss. Marc Jacobs, La Creme or Le Marc Lip Cream <laughs> in Je Temme. And then Sephora, Sephora brand Lip Ink in Rouge Infusion. Rouge Infusion. So it's a nice little collection. You really get a variety here. That I never use up a whole lipstick of anything. So um, for me, this kind of set is ideal. And for $25, you, you really can't beat that. So, and it's super cute. You get the little box. You know, it's 25, the, the nice thing about Sephora is that you get uh, freebies with your purchase as long as it's $25, but then they don't price things like this at $24.99. You know, it is $25 and you can get the freebies with this purchase. Do you know what I mean? It seems like there are some places where they're like, oh, it's a sale item. The, the sales on items $25 and up, but everything that you really want is $24.99. Do you know what I mean? So they, that's, it's almost nice you know, that they charge you just at that line. So especially if you have um, Sephora Flash, the shipping, the two day shipping, which I actually just paid for, you can just get your $25 item. So $25 item, freebie, free shipping, and then all the samples that will come with the usual Sephora purchase. So um, I'm really happy with Sephora right now. I really like these little kits. They're Sephora favorites kits. That's it for this little kit, guys. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comments below. And for right now, just give me a like or a thumbs up. I keep wanting to say like, like I'm on Facebook. Give me a thumbs up or subscribe. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. Bye.